Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuir. In this class, we will discuss about a statement. This is our first class in discrete mathematics. This class will help you understand the remaining classes. So, coming to today's class, first we are going to understand what statement means. Before understanding what statement, let's try to understand what sentence here is. Let's take a sentence, Hema is good and she study well. So, if you take this sentence, we can divide this sentence into two simpler sentences. Yes, Hema is good. This is one simpler sentence. Hema study well. This is another sentence. So, this is what you need to understand about sentence. Now, with this knowledge, we are going to understand what statement means. Statement, a declarative sentence. So, if it is want to be a statement, it has to follow two conditions. This is first condition and second condition. We are going to discuss both the conditions. A declarative sentence that cannot be broken into simpler sentences is called statement. We simply call it a statement or we call it as primary statement or atomic statement. So, what is the meaning of that? If you take any declarative sentence, that sentence cannot be divided into simpler sentences. Let us understand with an example. You take this sentence, Hema is good. Can you divide this sentence into simpler sentences? No. We call this as a statement. Hema study well. You take this sentence. Can you divide this sentence into simpler sentences? No. We call this as a statement. That is what the meaning of the first condition. A declarative sentence that cannot be broken into simpler sentences is called statement. What is the second condition? Let us understand the second condition. A declarative sentence which can assign one and only one of the two possible truth values. We call it as a, the only these two values can be assigned. A, any one of the truth value can be assigned. What, what, what is meant by truth values? Either true or false. We can assign any one of this value. With example, we are going to understand it better. Hema is good. If she is good, you say it as a true value. Hema study well. If she study well, what you say? Yes, this statement is true. If she, if she don't study well, you say it as false. Means any one of the truth value we can assign to this statement. Then we call it as a statement, either true or false. So, if you, if you call it as a statement, it has to follow these two conditions. Then only we call it as a statement or primary statement or atomic statement. Whatever the way you call, it is okay for it. Now, let us try to understand few examples on sentences and the examples which are not belonging to statements. Examples for statements. Delhi is the capital of India. Can you divide this statement into this sentence into two separate simpler sentences? No, we cannot separate. So that's why it is a statement. And it, it you can assign either true value or false value. Any one truth value can be assigned, not both. Delhi is the capital of India. Yes, it is true. We can assign any one of them, not both. Then we call it as a statement. Yes, this is a statement. It rained in the morning. If it is rained, if it rained in the morning, you say it as yes, true value. If, if, it, did, if it did not rain in the morning, you say it as false. Yes, this is a statement. Now coming to the next statement, Canada is a country. If it is a country, you say it as true. If it is not a country, you call it as a false. And you can you cannot divide this sentence into two simpler sentences. Yes, that's why we call this as a statement. Now take few examples which are not statements. What time is it? It is a question. Your answer will be something, some what is the present time? That is what you are going to answer. You cannot say it as yes or no, true or false. So that is why this is not a statement. Close the door. It is a command. You cannot say yes or no. You have to do some action. This is not a statement. 
सिमिलरली टेक द नेक्स्ट वन वन प्लस वन जीरो वन इज इक्वल टू वन वन जीरो कैन यू कॉल इट एज ए स्टेटमेंट नो Why we cannot call this as a statement? Let's try to understand. One plus one zero one is equal to one one zero. If you consider one this in binary numbers, it is true. If you consider this in decimal numbers, it is false. That's why we don't have a proper uh, understanding about it. You can assign true, or you can assign false. If you consider it in decimal, you can assign false. If you consider it in binary, you can assign true. so this is not accepted as a statement uh, that is what the condition says you can assign any one of the true values either true or false so this is what this is the basic understanding you need to have about statement hope you understand what statement means if you have any questions regarding the concept please post to questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you